and explode. Ah, 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 <laughs> You're going to Japan! <laughs> Shining a bright red as always as I read Lost and Red Max back at that says, yeah. Oh, well, why, why, why so, so fast? Uh, because this, 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 this is how I'm doing it now. I'm going to talk really fast all the time, and that's just my new thing now. Mm, you're going to run out of breath before you do that. I don't know about you, I got really, 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 really big lungs, you know, just their lungs are so huge, you couldn't possibly imagine. I just gotta hold my breath for four hours if I really want to. Okay, bigger muscles does not automatically mean bigger lungs. Yeah, but I got a bigger body, which means I got bigger lungs, which means I got more air capacity. I guess. So wait, we're gonna get this marker back to where it belongs in order to get this game what we're done over with. Talk normally, dang it. No, we're gonna talk really fast all the time because just how I am now. Yeah, that's what else is gonna happen. You're gonna get tug tied more. Okay, dramatic. Hey, there's stuff over there. There is indeed stuff over there. Which I need to there. go towards anyway in order to lift this bridge. That's, hey, you're supposed to have clothes on, man. It's weird. He's like... Kind of necromorph, but not really. He's not fully necromorphed yet. I was gonna say, are like, are these like early stage necromorphs? Probably. Because I think the infector takes a while. So the marker normally starts making necromorphs. Well, the thing is, the infector just does it quicker. Whereas, like... A anyone dead or anything dead really is just gonna become a necromorph. I think it fell through the floor. That or it was empty. I I've actually come across a couple of boxes that just have nothing in them. Oh hey, speaking of boxes. There's more over here. Ooh, um, No comment on that one? No. Because you keep eating them. Yes. They're delicious. They're not edible. They're nutritious. They're not edible. They're full of hot energy. That's it, I'm gonna squirt you with the wa water bottle. I'm just gonna, like, cut out that last bit of the sentence. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, so what's the point of these doors? This seems really counterintuitive. Well, remember, it's constantly a uh, dust storm out there. Oh. Ooh, and right. there's that. Oh, there's the sun. But yeah, those big doors were meant to keep the sand out, so... Now, are you sure it's not to keep him out? Well, he just showed up, so I don't know how well those long, how long those doors can hold against. Also, the music is very dramatic now. Well, yeah, we just saw a giant tentacle monster. I mean, is that really anything new for Isaac? Oh wow, that's a lot of. Uh, Ow! Oh, there you are. Okay, there you go. Oh, no, oh geez. Cut you in the pieces! I think he... No, he's right, go. Hi! Say goodbye to your kneecaps! Oh, you're not dead. Now yeah, you're dead. He doesn't really need a kneecap. Uh, my stomach when I'm hungry. Yeah, he it do kind of sound like that. Well, gun.
No more. I guess it is technically a rail gun. All right, go, baby, go. You still got one more time to go. I know. Put me back in the planet. Oh, you're going back in the planet. Get back in the jar. Seeing it on the explosive put on Also, thank you for the ammo. Oh, I forgot to open the things over there. Anyway, time to put this back on the podium. There you go. Hi. Objective complete. He did. He saved the world. Oh. What? What? What do you say? We are whole. He did it. Let's be on fire. Well. Also, like how you can see the big the chunk of this guy. Oh yeah. Impact imminent. Evacuate this area immediately. Oh, 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 yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Decontamination cycle activated. What could we possibly be contaminated with? Necromorph. Isaac. Isaac. You really didn't think I was just gonna walk away, did you? I was kind of hoping. I can't do that. Marker's coming with me. Also, how okay. are you fine? I mean, there's sand part of those being your eyes right now. Even if you are insane. What? You don't believe me? Take a look at yourself. Better yet, take a look at the video from Nicole. And this time, watch it right to the end. <laughs> Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. It's such a little thing. In the end, it all comes down to one little thing. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. Just once. I loved you. I always loved you. We just see a lurker jump on her last second. <laughs> <laughs> Baby. Well, I always wondered. Do you? Would you instantly die if you just 
stab yourself with a syringe full of air? Full of air? You wouldn't die immediately, but you would eventually have a heart attack. Because of, I don't know if it was just chemicals in there or if it was just air. Oh, it's probably a chemical mix. Wait, would it still kill her instantly? Uh, well, technically she would pass out and then probably die very shortly after. It depends on what she injected herself with, though. There are a lot of chemicals that do kill you relatively quickly. Especially if you inject a whole syringe worth right into your vein. That is true. It's just gravity. Just world shaking. We're good. And it's just a Mars quake. This isn't Mars. Where are we? Uh, Aegis 7, I think. It's just an Aegis quake. Ow. 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 Stop eating it all. But the line rats look like sandwiches. <laughs> they do, though. I mean, I guess. Like, if you took two line racks, they would look like pieces of bread. That doesn't make it edible, though. Uh, potato, potato. No, potato your stomach. <laughs> potato your stomach. Potato ulcer. <laughs> Yeah, uh, see, it's right here. Uh, your your fox boyfriend here. Uh, yeah, he keeps eating plasma, and his stomach is now an ulcer. Anyway, always oh, gonna ignore it. Ooh, with. And you know what? Capacity is probably what I'm not most of for now. I mean, you can get the final thing too. I I can. Heavy oh. damage, yeah. I, I guess I might as well max it out then. Now, I mean, like. It's, it's been a secondary weapon we use. I mean, we more than use the contact beam for bigger stuff. Yeah. Why not? Strange. I mean, it's not like it's gonna be. It's not like we're gonna use same war after this. How much money do we have? Not a ton, but we might as well buy some health. Uh oh. Oh. Let's just buy a little bit of ammo then. Uh, plasma cutter. And, uh, let's see. Do I have anything I don't want? Mostly just been ammo and health. Seems like it. I I thought we still had one more hockey puck. Mm, doesn't look like it. Well, maybe we should save to the jury save. Uh, I save before doing that, and I'm gonna save after. Anyway, uh, let's go outside. Let's stop the bitch. Oh boy. Hmm. This area has changed a bit. Yeah, when these containers get here. How oh, odd. This isn't OSHA compliant. This isn't OSHA compliant at all. Would OSHA care about stuff in space stuff? Huh. A lot of boxes. And I have a little too much to drink. Uh, oh my god. Woman detected technical. <laughs> You're going to Japan. How was it? Yeah, can you block the sun, please, Isaac? It's a little bright in the eyes. Oh. Oh no, don't worry. We got the biggest sun blocker in the world. Uh... Quite literally. Uh oh. A little more to the left. Thanks. No, wait. Come on. It's gotta look dramatic. Hi! 
I'm gonna shoot you in the puffing thing. Get rid of the pimples. You got a lot of facial acne. Oh, jeez. Uh oh. Oh, uh, roar! Yeah, keep screaming at me, buddy. That's clearly gonna kill me. Rawr, XD! I run out like a necromorph fucking in. Oh! Ah! Shit. My leg! Uh, shoot. Shoot it. Ah! Uh oh. Oh! Oh, this is precarious. Oh, this is hard to aim! Keep shooting. God! Oh my. Oh, it's got the numbing mouth. Uh oh. Whoa! Oh, we got one. Ow, don't spit your blood at me! What? Put me down! Gotta shoot the other one. I can't shoot the other one! Oh, 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 okay. Oh, it's getting uh, a little chewy. I was gonna say, he's getting a little too close there. He's getting a little nummy. A little, a little chewy. Oh. Uh, 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 oh, gun. Right. Now I gotta shoot his chin. Some chest pimples. Oh, I think that hit. I heard, I saw, I saw an explosion. Uh oh. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, mamas. White. Oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. oh, hey, thanks. Okay, thanks for killing your own man. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, are they gone? What, are they floating? They're floating. I missed. Oh, jeez. Oh, 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 okay. Whoa. Ooh. Um. It's just a little bruise. He's just throwing a little fit. I've got to shoot the chest again. Bam! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. He's looking the bodies around. Ah! Oh, thank you. Line! Ah, get off of me! Look, they're yellow now. Oh, I didn't even notice the lines are yellow. What does that mean? It means they're at full damage, basically. Slap. Bap. It's funny, you think a creature this large would have bigger limbs. Well, I mean, most of it could be stuck in the planet. I guess. Uh, more mamas. Have one of those. Oh, you killed both of them. I have no idea how I'm dodging these. Yeah, I mean, his attack pattern is pretty predictable. I know, but I'm not even trying to dodge them, it's just... <laughs> Excuse me as I turn to Muscle Man uh, for a brief moment. Ow! My mom. Uh, my mom. Uh, my mom. Uh, my mom. 
You know who else likes giant tentacle final bosses? Man! I think he'd grab those and throw it back. Probably. But I'm not gonna stick around and potentially be hit by them. Private, throw it back. Not like that, Private! What is that? I'm literally just running left and right and avoid some. Like I said, it's pretty predictable. Aww. Squishy. Right, I'm, gonna I'm done screwing around. Now the roof should protect me still. There you go. You know, I gotta wonder what purpose do these big yellow organs serve? Uh, video game wise, weak points. I mean, aside from that, I meant like biologically, what are they made for? Well, for the exploders, we know it explodes. Well, yeah. As for other things, I'm not sure. I guess it could keep joints stick together. I like how the brute has yellow things on his. Shoulders and legs. Uh oh. I think it's gonna fall over. Oh! Okay, time to leave. You think it's time to leave? I think it's time to leave. I, I don't know, I kinda wanna stay here now that the monster's gone. Awesome, okay, look up then. Oh, yeah! Okay, I think it's time to leave. <laughs> yeah, it's a time to leave. Oh, yeah, that's right. We gotta take the marker with us. Or not? Oh, hey, that worked. Man, screw this. I ain't taking our shit back with me. I, I love how he has that moment of, oh, hey, that worked. <laughs> Damn. I'm like, an engineer. That worked. Like, like you see, like his, ex like you can, you can tell, like inside his helmet, you can't see his face, but he's like, huh, huh. I didn't expect it. And Aegis was destroyed. It goes to the square hole. That was not square. <laughs> well, we did it, Max. We survived Dead Space on hard. Hooray. We now we gotta play Dead Space 3. Oh no! You already did Dead Space 2 with Matt then, so now we gotta do Dead Space 3. I did just. Oh, I did do a pl playthrough of Dead Space 2. I forgot I did that. It was such an <laughs> old playthrough. Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. Yeah, we don't want to listen to you no more. <sighs> Finally, I'm single again. But wait. Did I, I leave the oven on? <laughs> ah! And that's how it ends. Yeah, ends with a jump scare. Isn't it kind of yeah, weird how from Dead Space 1 to Dead Space 2, Nicole just kind of stops being a person and becomes a godlike entity? Well, I mean, to be fair, the the uh, marker did imprint something in our brain so we can make another mark. And that thing was Nicole. Yeah, but... It, it, I, I mean, Nicole is just like a physical representation. Well, not physical. I guess just a representation of the marker. Yeah, I just think it's fine that it continues to use that form after all these years. It's like, come on. I mean, we already know you're the marker. Yeah, but, I mean, it's also Isaac's ex-girlfriend, so it makes sense to torment her with that. Because, I mean, it was his idea that she could... Because she should go on the issue more. So he kind of blames himself for that. 
Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I think it's a stretch. You shouldn't have to blame yourself for that. It's not like you could have possibly known. Well, I mean, at that, in Dead Space 2, I mean, it's pretty obvious the Marker's just using that form with the Torture Ride. I, I mean, it, 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 Max, if I sent you on a cruise, and that cruise got struck by a meteor, I'm not gonna blame myself for sending you on that cruise. I'm gonna be like, wow, what are the odds of that? Also, oh no, Max is gone, I'm sad. But I'm not Jeez, gonna... Mate. I mean, Isaac blames himself for it. I don't, I, I don't know, just... Sending okay. someone to some place, I would not blame yourself for seeing that going wrong when... I mean, how could Isaac have possibly known that there's going to be a giant space rock that makes people mad zombies? Mm -hmm. I mean, granted, it is space, and you don't know what to expect out there, but... I don't know, I, I think blaming yourself for that is just a little bit of a stretch. Well, I'm pretty sure they've been dating for a long time, too, so... Johnny's son. Boris Wu. I mean, if you were infected by the marker, they prob it probably used me to torment you. Not like physical me, but like a mental reciprocation, you know? Well, you'd have to be, like, dead or gone. Well, if I was in this situation, I'd probably be dead. I mean, you are small and vulnerable. Yes. Nah, that's alright, I'll just stuff you in my hair and you'll be safe. But I'd be dead. I, I meant prior to anything happening. <laughs> <laughs> but, okay, if I'm in, on the issue more and the next outbreak happened, and I did the same thing as Nicole, I'd be dead already. Well, so here's the thing, Max. I wouldn't let you go to space by yourself. <laughs> but you just gonna follow me around 24-7? In space? Sure! Well, you heard it here first, folks. I'm not just gonna let you wander space all by yourself. I the last thing I'd want you to do is to end up lost somewhere and not have anyone be able to know where you are or what you're doing. I mean, Isaac kind of didn't know with Nicole. Well, yeah. Until, until the Necromorphs came out. And then he didn't know what was happening, but he did know where he, she was. I just think it's cute, though. You, you just put me in here and let me see if... Well, yeah, you're small and I have a lot of hair. Mom says you can't come in. Just imagine your little head just poking out like, Hey, Red, what's going on? It's like, not, not Max, go back to sleep. <laughs> well, I don't think I'd be sleeping if I just hear... <laughs> But no, it's like the episode of Adventure Time. Remember when Finn uh, had uh, Jake in his pocket? Yeah. <laughs> Which is funny, because throughout the entire episode, Jake just wasn't present until that last moment. I don't think the voice actor was there at that time. Do you think that's what it was? I don't know, probably. Or, or maybe they didn't know how to include him in the story, so they're just like, uh, just have him be in Finn's pocket for some reason. I guess, I guess so. He only, he, he only had one line of dialogue, and that was just a little fart. That's not even... <laughs> <laughs> I, you, you're right, probably not. Besides, I'm pretty sure I would have a weapon, too, helping you out and trying to kill the Necromorph. Uh, I don't want you to mess up my hair! Your hair's already red. No, I don't want you firing a weapon in my hair. I, I, I damage mean, my hair. I'm before you do it. I'm not gonna shoot it while I'm in the hair. I, no, if you're in that situation, you get in the air and you stay in there. Then a necromorph would sneak up on you and then attack you. Well, that's when you can poke your horns out. Oh, so you can't sneak up on me. I'm Red Luster.
Now I imagine someone doing like a quick cut of every time a necromorph is sneaked up on you in this <laughs> game. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I'll make a compilation of that just for this moment. Also, military <laughs> suit, backstory logs, money, power nodes, and impossible mode. Yeah, I don't think I do impossible mode. Yeah, me neither. Impossible mode doesn't even let you take all that stuff, does it? I don't think it does. Oh, well. That's the end. New... Huh? Maybe it's New Game Plus or something, I don't know. Oh, uh, maybe. Anyway, that was the d d d d d dead space. Max, was your final wisdom? Um, don't go to space. Space sucks. Yeah, I mean, space is like the ocean, but worse. I mean, that's debatable. I mean, they're both they're both vast bodies, they both can't be breathed in, and no one knows what's in them. Yeah, but here's the thing, though. We know more of space than our own oceans. Not technically true. Okay, we know you more know what's down there, then? We know more about the moon than we know about uh, than the ocean. But space yeah. is infinite. You couldn't possibly know more about the space than you know about the ocean. I mean, still, though. There is there is no competition. Okay, do you know what's down there, then? No, I'm saying this is like comparing a, a book to a library. Just because it's a really big book, the library is going to have infinitely more information in it. Okay, but still. But you get my point. Do you know what's down there? Uh, fish. I mean, all the way at the bottom. Bigger fish? I don't know if normal fish can survive all the way down there. Uh, well, not normal fish. But anyway, this, what was your final wisdom? Oh, wait, right, it was don't go to space. Uh, yeah, I agree. Don't go to space. Uh, don't go to space. Unless there's ice cream. That's not dumb. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how Red Luster became a necromorph. He, <laughs> he went to the that marker. That would be the reason it, why you become a necromorph. <laughs> he went to the marker because it promised him ice cream. <laughs> oh my goodness. But, uh, no, Red Luster couldn't possibly become a necromorph because he's not organic. Okay, but what about me? I still exist. Uh, I'm in your hair. Yeah, but are demonic entities technically organic? I'm made of flesh. Well, I, I mean... Are you? What else would it be made of? Stone? <laughs> yeah, I have bone too. I mean, think about it. What's what's in hell? Fire and rocks. And then there's creatures in there that are made of flesh and bone. I figure they'd be made of rock. If they're a golem, then yeah. Or a gargoyle. Or that too. But um, it depends on the gargoyle. Anyway, we're going way off topic. And besides, gargoyles are supposed to fight evil, not be evil. This has been Red Luster, signing out. Bye-bye.